All right, hello. Night start tonight. We're getting this at night time. Dylan, say good day. Just on the way to see um, Michael's band as a rival again. Go check them out. So this is the last show of their tour. Pro tip, don't drive into the city at night on a weekend because there's no parking. Just take the train, Brennan. Just take the train. So there's a park here, right where we need to turn down. A bit windy. It's a windy day today. Just uh, hello. Just out in um, Northcote, Patrick, and we're just heading to the fifth annual Salami Festival because you know that wog life, keeping it real. We made it into the Salami Festival. There's a lot of people. We made my, my salami, please come on. Honey and mortadella. Honey and mortadella. Because today is your honey day. Exactly. Thank you. There you are. What do you think? Not bad. Because it's salty and sweet. Salty and sweet. We just got out of the Salami Festival. It's pretty windy today, so um, yeah, couldn't really do much vlogging outside. And it's super packed and noisy on the inside. And let me take my jacket off because I'm super hot. It was really good. Heaps of um, cold cut deli meats. Lots of salami, tasted a lot of things. Um, what did you think? What are your thoughts? Yeah. It's pretty good. Pretty good salami. Pretty good salami. I got in for free because there was a, some dude standing out the front of the line. He had like salami in the competition. And he's like, oh, do you want a free ticket? And I was like, yeah, man. He's like, what do I have to do? And he's like, oh, just vote for me in the competition. And I was like, yeah, sick, I don't care because, you know, we just let eat all the free salami. So that was fun. I got in for free. It wasn't really much else. There's like, you know, a few anti-pasto things. But um, it's just mostly like cold cuts, which for um, us fellow wogs is just choice man heaps of just free salami and like ham and mortadella and prosciutto oh mate and the cannolis i didn't get a video of them because i was too excited about the cannolis but how are the cannolis good cannolis mm. i'd like to go again but hopefully they have a bigger venue because if you can see on the video that's pretty packed there's lots of people in like a small space or unless they just have more room to walk around it's just you're smashed in with all these other wogs trying to eat salami but you know other than that, good event. Salami festival. Wait. So I thought it is time for a little movie update or like filmmaking update. And just, you know, cover all the things that I'm doing filmmaking wise at the moment. Yeah, why not? Um, oh, I need, to blow my, I need to blow my nose. All right, blow my nose. It's gonna start off with, um, Remember our, the film I did a couple weeks ago, The Round Table, with Justin and all the gang? It got into the Sunshine Film Festival. We found out last week, so that's pretty exciting. So hopefully the film does all right in there and people seem to enjoy it, I hope so. So if you want to come along, just check out the Sunshine Film Festival website. Yeah, you know, support the team. It'll be fun to see anyone there. That's the first film I've had in a festival before. So that'll be exciting, it'll be a cool experience. 
Hopefully you get to meet some cool people along the way as well. And then next, I'm working on my film project called Highway. That's the one I'm working on with Anthony. I don't want to give too much away. It, the story follows a um, hitman driving down the highway with a drug dealer and the drug dealer has to um, perform his first hit and then drama ensues. So yeah, get excited for that one. Just getting prepared for that one really, getting that, trying to get that organized. I met up with Anthony last week. We started going over some shot ideas. That was really good. I didn't vlog any of that because I kind of forgot because I was too excited. Yeah, really immersed in what we're working on. So we got some cool shot ideas going. It'll be really stylish and cool. So hopefully getting a rough idea of what we want to shoot and how we want it to look. Try and organize the rest of the film locations, the rest of the cast. I met up with actor friend um, Ben the other week. He was in the round table. I think, you, yeah, you saw Ben in the round table vlogs. Um, he's jumped on board the film, which is pretty fun. The film, they're only just supporting characters. Ooh, just started raining. I just want to cut in for a little bit. So today I'm doing this on recording this moment on Sunday right and from those living in Melbourne I don't know if it was you know for those um, watching in Maui but um it was super duper windy today like crazy winds and I was saying to Patrick you know if it's windy like this, this is just high winds kind of thing imagine what a hurricane would be like and to experience that would just be crazy um there's my insight for the day that's about it start rehearsing soon It'll be fun because I want to do a couple of those because, you know, I make sure it's, all the characters are really fleshed out and planning to shoot in a few months' time. So maybe like late December, early January, maybe. Hopefully if all things, all things go to plan. I hope you all enjoyed my little meme magic trick video. I was just sitting around, I was like, hey, I got a funny idea. So yeah, hope everyone enjoyed that. I would like to do a few more little um, sketch kind of things every now and again to try and bring more people to my channel, bring new um, viewers to my channel and that kind of thing. Look out for a few um, little videos here and there amongst the weekly vlogs. So that should be fun. And yeah, that's kind of it filmmaking wise. Roundtable got into the Sunshine Film Festival. Sick. So if anyone wants to um, come along, bring yourself. You have to buy tickets, of course, and do all that kind of thing. Just working on highway at the moment films then after highway move on to the next one i guess thanks for watching guys and probably see you in the next video